Hey John here, so I got this Honda uh, 13 horse uh, GX3 390. The complaint was uh, th it's got kickback, like uh, recoil kick, like there. Pulls the cord right out of the guy's hand. And uh, <coughs> as you can see here, he said it broke this. Thing snapped back. Uh, so I have a feeling I know what it is. I don't think it's a uh, broken keyway or anything out of time. I think uh, it's probably just a valve adjustment. And I just want to show you. Uh, uh, more than the valve adjustment, the ACR, the automatic uh, recoil, uh, compression recoil, uh, automatic compression uh, release <coughs> in, on your crankshaft there, it's probably, uh, you know, out of whack, the, the exhaust valve, and it's probably causing this. So I just want to show you how to, you know, uh, adjust that or look for that, see if it's uh, still working. So let me, uh, let me take you in a little closer. So all we're going to do is take this valve cover off and I'll show you what to look for when you're pulling the engine over as far as uh, to see if your ACR is actually working. Just a 10 millimeter bowl here. Take this valve cover off. This should be easy, easy fix. It's probably out of whack. The, uh, the valve adjustment, the valve lash. Alright, so <coughs> let's see what we got here. So this is the exhaust side here. Or that's the intake. This is the, this is the exhaust over here. I gotta rotate it, get it to top dead center. Alright, so I'm just taking a <coughs> spark plug out and make less compression here. So we can turn this over, find top dead center, and I'll show you what to look for. So get something, get something thin, put in the hole. Alright, so top dead center, both of them are uh, loose. Alright, this wire's in the way, of course. This is the exhaust valve right here. See how it's loose? Everything's loose. That's the top dead center. Watch when I pull it over. Another rotation. Alright, keep an eye on this. It's going to bump just a little bit just before it gets to the top dead center. See a bump? That means the ACR is still working. Watch again. I'm just looking at this. Uh, this exhaust valve. So when it comes back up to top dead center, it's coming soon here. Did you see that little indent? That's what the uh, ACR is all about, just to relieve a little pressure. So maybe just an adjustment on this valve will do the trick. Spec is 020, but that's a little loose. I'm going to tighten it up a little bit. I'm going to tighten that up a little bit. Because uh, I want it a little tighter. You could put both of these really at 0.15. Actually, they're both. Both could be a little tightened. Well, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to tighten them both. Just a little bit to 0.015. Uh, so I'm gonna. <coughs> I set the uh, intake at 0 0.015. Same thing on uh, this one. 0 0.015. Oops, I think I just turned it. 0 0.015 on both of them. A little bit tight. <coughs> Sorry. All right, so coming up to top dead center, see that bump? It's a little more profound now. So that should take the compression out of the uh, starting mechanism. Boop, see it? So that's how you adjust that. If there was no bump there, that would that would mean internally that your, uh, you know, the uh, ACR on a, it, it works on a spring. Sometimes a spring breaks, and then that thing wouldn't work. 
Uh, I've seen that on a Briggs, not necessarily a Honda, but because I don't know what exactly what the Hondas look like inside as far as uh, how the ACR works. But let's uh, let's put this valve cover back on and start this up. See if there's any compression now. All right. So to adjust this valve, you would put this is a jam nut here. I think it's a 10 millimeter bolt, uh, 10 millimeter nut, and this. Uh, this nut here is a, uh, I believe a 14, not sure, but um, so you would hold this, loosen the jam nut, and just turn this 14 millimeter one way or the other, just a hair. It doesn't take much to, uh, you know, we're talking millimeters here, uh, whatever, whatever way you need to. You have your feeler gauge behind here, and, uh, you know, like I said, left or right to loosen or tighten, and then hold this 14 millimeter and then tighten it. 10 millimeter bolt jam nut, and that's how you adjust the valve. It's pretty simple. There we go. Right. Let's see if this thing will start now. On, on, choke. solved no kickback just uh the valves were out of whack that's it